This is a quick demonstration of the C. Davis Compact Crimp series of GWT machines. This crimper is designed to go inside of a larger machine that'll do most of the automated wire stripping and serve as the crimp section of it. It can also be used, as you see, on a bench top, usually with something like a Panavice type mount, but here we just have it mounted uh, on a piece of angle iron for convenience. The system comes in four separate pieces so that it can integrate into the machine wherever it is best. We have the crimp section right here, which is designed to be as narrow and space-saving as possible to go into the widest variety of machine configurations. We have the touchscreen interface on a 10 or 15 foot cable. That's just, again, so that the touchscreen can go wherever it needs to go. The electrical box, which contains all of the innards and pneumatics. Right now we just have a a pseudo uh, interface on here. Normally this would be a cable to your external machine, but it can also be used just with a foot pedal if you're using it as a bench top. The fourth piece, of course, is the bowl, is the vibratory bowl feeder and slide system. This both orients the loose contacts and blows them to the crimping station. So we'll go ahead and give a quick demonstration of running the crimping station as a bench top. So I'm going to select my language, select whether I'm using the pins or the sockets, the upper or lower bowl, and I'll go ahead and run. So instantly what you see, a pin has been shuttled over from the slide through the Y tube to the crimper. The crimper has now gripped the contact by closing slightly. So the contact is now held firmly between the indenters, but it's not actually crimping down. The ready light is on, both on here and down there. This warning is just a, a soft warning saying that nothing's happened for a little bit, because normally these are, again, in automated machines where it would be expecting a wire to be inserted and crimped immediately. But, you know, at this point, the ready has come on, letting the machine or the operator know that a contact has appeared at the crimper. There's actually a fiber unit that detects when there's a contact in there, and it is ready to have a wire inserted and crimped. This button here is just going to simulate either our foot pedal or a command from the machine. The wire just inserts in, the pedal is depressed, and we have a crimp.